My name is April Sullivan and I'm a first year PA student here at Oklahoma City University. The reason that I first started looking at the PA profession was as a dental hygienist, I, I really loved that environment and uh, working in an office with people who were taking care of people and other medical professionals. And I, just, I love taking care of my patients and kind of having the knowledge to be able to help them. What I found was that I was just limited as a hygienist. You know, I could only do so much. I looked into medical school, um, but being an, an older person, <laughs> Um, it wasn't the route I wanted to take with two kids and, you know, to commit to that time. But really, the sky's the limit on what you can do as a professional in the PA program. I applied to several other programs and, and did some interviews with other programs. And what really drew me to OCU was, and this is more of a personal experience, but it just felt right. It felt like, I don't know, for lack of a better word and to be kind of cheesy, it just felt like home. And this first year, you spend a lot of time in the classroom and you spend a lot of time studying. But what is really unique to this program and something that I feel like sets the program above and beyond maybe other programs is that all throughout the year, we are getting personal hands-on experience with standardized patients and then with real live patients at Good Shepherd. And that's been something that honestly is just invaluable. We are being taught from the start how to interact with patients and how to do a good job of drawing out their story. The other thing that's built into this year is learning procedures, and that's a hands-on thing too. And that is learning um, suturing and placing a central line. And um, you know, just yesterday we did lumbar punctures and. So you're getting that experience on both um, kind of mechanical models that are set up for medical learning and then also um, with cadavers. Dr. Britton, who is our, our program director right now, um, you know, he has had 30 years of experience in education, medical education, and he's developed curriculum and he has worked with, with uh, building residencies and, you know, he has has kind of done it all. The one thing that has always stood out to me with the faculty is they just call you to rise and they call you to um, be as good as they are and to work as hard as they do. You know, it's not them sitting there telling you day after day, you have to do this, you have to know this, you have to learn this. It is providing an example of the type of provider that you want to be and because they they have a passion for medicine and a passion for people. They want, when we get out, to be the very best and provide an exceptional level of care to our patients, and that's what they're here for. These people, they are just a, a step above, in my opinion, because you walk in and you can just feel that they care about you as a person, and they care about your family, and they care about where you came from, and they care about what you're gonna do and what you're gonna be. And that, again, comes back to they care about the people of Oklahoma and they care about our patients. And they want to create an environment that is perfect for learning and teaching us to provide a level of care that is exceptional.